So, in Once Human, you are going to have to do a lot of harvesting and mining at the start of the game. When it comes to logs and ores, it's going to take you quite a while to get yourself built up. But there is a way to AFK and essentially get infinite resources. So that's exactly what we're going to cover in this video. And if we drop down into my base, you are going to see my deviations. The two you are going for are the Digby Boy and the Logging Beaver. What the Digby boy is going to do is he is going to go out on his own when he's in a securement unit at your base and he is going to find ores. And what the logging beaver is going to do is he's going to go out and he's going to find logs. So these are going to work whilst you're out doing quests, whilst you're away from the game. Like if you go for your dinner or something like that, these are still going to work providing they have the power and the mood and stuff. And they're just going to bring you back logs and ores without you having to lift a finger. So in order to get your hands on the Digby boy, there are two ways I have found so far. The first one is there's a guy at Deadsville called Low. He's basically going to do the early game deviation quests with you. He's eventually going to give you a quest to go up to Throughville. And when you're there, there's going to be a Digby boy. You have to take him 30 copper ores. When you do, he's going to become your deviation. And the other way to get your hands on Digby boy is to just mine the silver ore or tin ore that you can find pretty much anywhere. Like once you've left that first part of the Dayton wetlands over here, like where you start the game, once you've left there, you're going to find a lot of tin ore. There's going to be a lot of silver ore. And harvesting those has a chance. I'm not sure how rare it is, but it does have a chance of giving you a Digby boy. You'll see I've got one in this securement unit. I've got one over here and I've got another one here. So currently I have three. I am on my way to getting more hopefully soon. And next up being the logging beaver. These ones are a little bit more time consuming to get your hands on, I'm going to say. But these are the ones that are going to go out and get you logs. So in order to get your hands on these, what you're going to do is make enough progress in the game to go way past Deadsville. You're going to come down to Mayor's Market. And on the south side, right here on the map, there is a dock. So if we have a look over here, because I've got my camp set up over here now for easier access to a lot of stuff. If we come over here to this dock, right on that edge over there... There is a chance to see a bubble floating, which is the logging beaver. So now we're on the dock. The bubble can sort of like spawn around this sort of area where I'm standing. Like it'd basically be above my head. However, if the bubble is not there and the logging beaver is not here, then what you want to do is run up to the teleportation tower inside the uh, marketplace. So if we come past all of this, there's going to be a little ledge you can jump on over here to climb up. So if we jump up here, and then we jump up to the second bit as well, inside this building is the teleportation tower. There is also a chance to get an extra dimensional cat in here sometimes. That is another deviation, so you'll see the bubble. When you're at the teleportation tower, instead of using it with F, if you press G and switch to another world, there are going to be a bunch of different worlds that are all within the same server. So these are not going to change your server. These are just different instances within the same server. However, the world that I'm currently in, World 3, it has a little star there. That's because that's the instance my base is in. So if I change over, let's say we go to World 5, and I switch, then it switches almost instantly, little bits of lag every now and then. But if we come over and have a look, I'm not sure if you can actually see them from this far away. But what you want to do is go down there, have a look, see if the logging beaver's there. If not, come back to the teleportation tower and switch to a different world. When you want to go back to your base and you've found enough logging beavers, then just go back to the one that's got the little star. So we switch over again to world three. And now I'm back in the normal instance where I am currently playing, like the main one where my base is. And there's always a chance, it's just at the moment, there are a lot of people going for these logging beavers. So they are hardly ever there. I had to switch through like four or five different instances just to find one. But I did manage to find one. That's exactly how you get your hands on the logging beaver. And when you have the logging beaver and the digby boy, stick them in a securement unit at your base. And they are going to go off on their own whilst you're doing literally anything else. And they are going to bring you back ores and logs. So they are very, very helpful and as far as I'm aware, there is no idle timer in this game. So I've managed to go away for like an hour at a time, come back, and they've got a bunch of goodies for me. But that is exactly how you can AFK and get infinite resources in Once Human. And what we are going to do is leave that video there. Let me know your thoughts and stuff about this game in the comments. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it helped you well.
Thank you for watching.